hey guys welcome back to my channel so i know i haven't vlogged in a very long time but today i am going to an induced labor um due to the fact that my blood pressure is high and there was um protein in my urine so i'm in the room already i'm admitted as you can see they want me to they want me to put on the socks and the and the stuff i was I was not ready for this right now. Eh? No. Yeah, I gotta put on the gown and the socks. I'm gonna show you guys around the room once I get changed. I had to give some urine out, of course, and then let's do this. It's gonna be my fucking labor. I can't believe it. And like, my due date's like literally two weeks away. It's like April 18th and I wasn't supposed to give birth until May 2nd. So I'm two weeks ahead of schedule. I'm not fucking ready for this, but let's fucking do it anyway. So, got my, my mom here. Hi mom. My V is in already. Yes, they're monitoring me. <laughs> Y lo hermana. Vino. Sí. Ay, padre, se le queda la misericordia. Mama. Oh, Jesus. Uh, contractions are coming in strong I have like a balloon that's gonna help me dilate I'm already like three like about an hour ago they checked me and I was three centimeters so now so now I'll be a little bit more I should be a little bit more by now so this is basically like what they put on you to monitor the heartbeat the baby's heartbeat and like to see like to measure how far my contractions are i've been getting contractions they're a little bit stronger now <sighs> I might be taking an epidural soon as soon as i'm done eating Food. I'm fucking starving. <sighs> Freeze! Could you hand me the sound wave generator? This is bullshit. Special Ed Science Fair is turning into a love yeah, fest for so Jimmy guys. and Tammy. Okay, guys. Pitocin is up. It is what time? It is 1:20 in the morning. 1:20. Yeah, the time's a little off, so it's like 1.21 in the morning. <sighs> My mom is still here. I had the balloon in, but they just took it out. And I'll be back. I'm probably gonna... I'm probably gonna get that epidural soon, because this little bastard right here is going to put me in a lot of pain right now so it's 3 54 they just broke my water i got an epidural like half an hour ago so i'm not feeling as much pain as i was earlier and i'm on like they got me on five on pitocin which is only gonna get worse but luckily with the epidural i'm not gonna feel it as much so I'm gonna try to get some rest now because it's gonna be a long couple hours. I'm, I'm still three centimeters, so I gotta stay here. And yet more time dining? Well, now you can make that happen with the new Bravo XL, the world's first compact uh, smart oven with flavor infusion technology. It's a breakthrough in culinary good. creations. Bravo is not your regular toaster oven, but it's instead a high tech cooking appliance with precision heat control, three convection fan speeds. Five I'm gonna go out. back to sleep so you can get some more rest. So, they just checked me and I'm still 
force and I'm like not dilating as much as I like. It's already daytime. <sighs> Just praying that um she she starts to come down more, hopefully. I'm a little nervous about getting a C section. I mean it's not a big deal but coming from somebody that gave vaginal birth twice already and like section for me is not really the way to go. I'm gonna keep my fingers crossed and hopefully everything works out for the best as long as she's healthy. That's the most important part and she is. They got me sitting in like certain position. See if the baby comes down like now that I remember with my with my daughter I had to like I was stuck on seven centimeters for a little bit and I had to um rotate from like side to side and then that was what kind of helped me um dilate a little bit more so keep my keep my like keep my fingers crossed and see what happens i'm just so tired i probably slept like only half an hour so i'm like eight centimeters now it's 10 53 in the morning I'm about to start pushing soon. I feel so much pressure and pain. So the baby's gonna be coming out. Very hey, hi. Hi. It's a video, puppy. It's a video. The kids hi. came to visit me real quick. It's 10:53 now. Still, I'm eight centimeters, but I'm probably gonna be. No, they're just monitoring the baby right there. And this is my medicine and stuff. What's that in your finger? It's to monitor my oxygen to see if I'm breathing okay. Okay. Yeah. What's that in that? What? This is a IV. That's where the, you see that right there? Yeah. It's going in through my vein. Is it hurting? Uh, not too much. Not too much? Nope. Not too much. What is the much. baby doing? She's just chilling. Crystal's here. I thought I was playing with the beef. Make us turn. <laughs> it's 11.35. Um, the doctors are probably going to come in in a little bit and recheck me. Hopefully, Crystal does a little quickness. <laughs> We're not going to be able to do like the full glam, but because my daughter decided to fully dilate and the head's like literally right there. Right there. <laughs> They're giving us 10 minutes. So Chris was on a... So we could do a quick beat. <laughs> a quick beat. <laughs> a nice picture at least. <laughs> So guys, I finally finished with labor and I'm breastfeeding my child. Uh, I think it took me like about 20 minutes in total to to um, to push her out. Well, she's out now. Crystal did my makeup. We did it like yes, we had I to did. do like yeah, we had to makeup do it really by quick. K Glam. Makeup by K Glam, of course. And this is like a real like regular look because we had no time because I yes. was literally like 10 a quick fifteen minute, quick fifteen minute look. Yes, some yeah. highlight just to get her glowing. Mm -hmm. Come on, mascara. My mom's here. Yes. Hola, estoy feliz porque nació mi otra nietecita bella. We are at Presbyterian Hospital, oh, guys. Look at the view. This is her delivery room. Oh, Here she is she with Mama. Rojita. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Aww. I'm gonna leave her skin to skin. Mm -hmm. And Ratika will try to see if she's interested in feeding. Mm -hmm. I didn't give her any more food because, you know, we're giving her a break to cuddle with you. Uh, Deja skin to skin and we'll try feeding breast. Okay. Her sugar, I checked, oh my is God. perfect right now. <laughs> what was it? 51. Okay. For babies that are, she's not four hours. Yet. So guys, I gave birth yesterday and she officially has like 24 hours. I can't wait to show you guys. Um, I'm actually in the bathroom. She's sleeping right now. I'm gonna, I'm finally able to take a shower. I got my IV taken out and stuff. So I'm gonna go shower now and you know, um, I'm a little bit in pain when I when I try to breastfeed. Like my boobs contract, like my stomach starts contracting, like if I'm having contractions. I will be doing another video um, when I get home tomorrow. I'm gonna try to like upload as much videos as I can, and I'm gonna see if I later on today I edit this video and have it up for you guys tomorrow. So thank you for joining me on this journey i really appreciate everybody that was um seeing their prayers sending their prayers and everybody that has congratulated me um if i didn't get to say thank you i really appreciate it bye